Welcome to the World Tarot. Let's get another weekend surprise for Divine Feminine. I want only positive stuff in this one, okay? So, wh whoever is going to be watching this video, please send your energies to my cards here. And let's get the most accurate reading for this weekend. Let's get some pleasant surprises only that Divine Feminines can expect. Universe, please help me channel a message for Divine Feminine, something likely to resonate with the people who will be watching this video. The most accurate messages for people who will be watching this video, please. And let's get only the pleasant surprises. Let's have a only positive reading. Okay, let's get the best surprises that Feminines can expect, Divine Feminines can expect this weekend. So now, help me describe, Universe, please help me describe the Feminines who will be watching. Universe, please help me describe the Divine Feminines who will be watching this reading, please. Please. Help me describe the Divine Feminines. So, I, I always prefer to describe the people who are watching, right? So you can tell quickly if it resonates or not, so I don't waste people's times here. Time is precious. Okay, so let's see who who is this group of divine feminines. Uh oh, yeah, you really need whoever you are. You really need a pleasant surprise because you feel like you're stuck right now. You feel like you're stuck in karmic patterns, in karmic cycles. What's happening? Okay, you want the truth, and you want to stand in your power here. You are standing in your power, but still, you are you're still affected by things from the past that may have caused a lot of mental turmoil for you. And you just like want to cut this out basically and go to the Nine of Pentacles rather than being in the Eight of Swords where you're tied up. Yeah, you want to get out. You want to break free. You want to break free. Literally, that's what I'm getting. So, are you going to break free? What's happening this weekend? Something good. Something nice. This one wanted to come out. No longer waiting for your ships to come in. Something might come in, actually. Something you've been waiting for. You'll no longer have to wait for something. What is this? What's coming in? What should you expect? What, what's the pleasant surprise? Yeah, it could be something you've been waiting. Okay, Ace of Wands. Like a new beginning, a, a fresh start. It could be someone bringing the wand, but not necessarily. I feel like it, it's just going to be... Okay, it might be. It might be traveling. You might travel. It might be a surprise. Maybe someone wants to take you on holiday somewhere, you know, to get you out of the state. Yeah, it's going to be very fulfilling. You, you'll you feel super, like you see you're going to get from the Eight of Swords to the, the Ten of Cups, like whoosh, instantly. Yeah, someone might offer you to travel with them or something like that. So this is like, this is traveling with the waiting for your ships to come in. It's like waiting to travel. And now you will actually travel. And you'll be very happy this weekend. You'll have a very fun weekend. And it might be someone like coming out of the blue offering you to, to go on holiday with them. All of this stuff flipped over, so I'm going to take it. So this is no longer feeling sad, you see? Getting out of this kind of energy where you feel stuck and sad. And you'll feel like 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 a reunion you feel like finally yeah i think this is a re some someone's just gonna come out of the blue and say go on holiday with me someone who's very passionate about you and they want to have a family with you they want everything with you look at that they really want to put in work and effort they want to heal the relationship and they, they're gonna come in very quickly and maybe they were yeah they're coming in quickly towards you, even though you're super guarded here, but they want to come and express everything to tell you the truth, because you want the truth, right? You're stuck here in your head and you want the truth, and this person's coming towards you to tell you the truth, and to, even though they see that you're very guarded, that you've turned your back on them. Wow. So yeah, that's your, your surprise. Should you, should you, Accept this person's offer. I think they want to take you on holiday. Basically, they want to make amends and take you on holiday. Free of pentacles. It's like you should work with them. It's like, yeah, you, you can work with this person. Kind of like that. <sighs> okay. 
okay the, okay they're, they're serious they're the king of pentacles and the king of wands look at that yeah they, they've grown up they're your counterpart now they're gonna come correct like i told them to <laughs> two of pentacles um uh, yeah so they're gonna be they're gonna be discussing a lot of feelings how how are we gonna come together how everything's gonna work out with the two of pentacles here and like they will like say that they they know there's a lot of work that needs to be done in order to 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 have this union and they're ready to put in the work maybe uh, this is usually like a blockage like blocking but in this case i feel like they've seen things from a higher perspective they've risen above their ego with the seven of wands here yeah that's kind of what i'm getting i don't think they'll be blocking this off anymore I feel like they've been seeing things from another perspective and they know that they need to heal the situation in order to have a new beginning with you. Okay, so... Yeah, they're serious, okay? They have both passion and they want stability. So they want everything and they know that they're your counterparts. You see, Queen of Wands, King of Wands, Four of Wands. When I have these three together, it means that like that's like a twin flame union. Like both of you know that you're twin flames and you want to come into union. That's that's kind of what I'm getting here. So this person may, may be quite spiritual too. Or they may have become spiritual in the meantime, you know, while working on themselves, you know. They've been going through some kind of spiritual awakening, you know. And they're... Uh, why do I keep saying, you know? Before I used to say okay a lot. Now I say, you know. Oh my god. Never mind. Never mind. Eight of Wands reversed. So, yeah, this might be a no communication situation right now. And this person may have blocked you and there's no communication. So is this ending, is this kind of situation ending or you blocked them because they were acting shady. But you're the one who feels stuck, so they might have blocked you. Because you, you're stuck and you wanted to, to hear the truth, right? You want to hear talking. Talking. But here it's like you're blocked and nobody's talking. Okay, so is this going to end for good now? Oh my god, five of swords in the upright. If it was reversed, it would be like, yes, it's ending, but... Uh, yeah, there might have been a, a harsh argument right before you stopped this, uh, communicating, and that's what led to the blocking and the no communication. Some of... one of you was harsh, or both of you were harsh to each other for very... for different reasons. Maybe someone wanted to win at all costs. Maybe this guy was kind of a bully towards you. So there, there was a very painful ending. So is it going to be? Yeah, it's the end. I wanted to, uh, to ask if this is the end of the pain, painful cycle. And it's the end. Yes, we're going to end this crap. Okay. So should you take this person back? Should you? It, it kind of flipped on the side. You saw that? It didn't, it's not right. It's, it's kind of like up to you maybe. Or maybe you need to make sure that this person and that both of you are like feeling fulfilled, feeling okay, you know, that you have enough self-love to come together into a healthy union here. So, okay, fine, fine. There's a lot of love here, okay? It's a deep love and I think it's mutual. Yeah, you're moving into calmer waters. You, the feelings are gonna... The, these kinds of turbulent feelings are gone and we're getting more pleasant feelings here. Yeah, okay. Whew. And there might be traveling. You might travel, like I said. You might go on holiday somewhere and on a retreat and discuss your feelings, discuss the situation, discuss how you can move forward, how you can get out of this kind of energy. Yeah. So there's your pleasant surprise. I hope this helps and I hope we will resonate with this okay i hope you have a lovely holiday short weekend getaway or whatever it is i hope this helps take care bye bye